Hi everybody, what's up? Hello from Costa Rica. My name is Paco Iswadil India. Namaste. Something cool happened in Costa Rica was this. This is a sad card. If you look at it, it says greetings. <laughs> Welcome to Costa Rica. And something cool here is this QR code and this is my password which everybody's seeing right now which I can claim. So basically what this card is letting you do is on this deposit I can put in my Bitcoin and I can give this card to anybody who has this Bitcoin. They'll just get Bitcoin on a card. They don't need any application right now to receive from me. But to withdraw it out you need to use an application called Nunchuck. All right, so that's where it says tap. So we're gonna to work together and see how this one works. So you get a really idea of how you can use a Sats card and how can you spend your Sats card too. So let's start with step one. Let's start by loading this with Bitcoin. So as you can see this one, you're gonna deposit some Bitcoin right here. So I'm gonna go over to my wallet. I use my Moon wallet for example. Okay, let's go Moon. And I'm locked in. This is my moon wallet. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna click on send. I'm gonna go and scan. So I'm gonna just scan this out. And I hope you can see this. Uh, Did it work? Wait a minute. Let's scan from here. Oh, perfect. It's scanned. And now it's detected my address, which is out there. And it is written also here in the bottom here below this QR code. So I'm gonna go down here and I'm just gonna put in, let's say sats. I'm gonna put in about 50,000 sats. So I put in about 50,000 sats, confirm amount. I'm just gonna write sats card, sats card card confirm note the fee is going really high I'm just gonna go ahead with it and I'm gonna click on 15 sats per byte confirming fee and sending and gone you see that minus anyway so now this card has got 50,000 sats on it and how do you claim this now anybody who has access to this card has access to the secret pin code which is right here it is here the 554746 yes 554746 anybody who sees this can claim the bitcoin on this card that's it that's so simple very much awesome right to but to access this card you need an nfc enabled phone and my phone is nfc enabled so what i'm gonna do right now is this is awesome and let's go this is my phone i'm gonna go tap this card here you see i tap and something awesome opens you see this it's card it shows my qr code and if you scroll down it shows the transaction here it says unconfirmed oh sorry it says unconfirmed transaction for fifty thousand sats now that is amazing it says I can view it in the blockchain explorer so I click on the view and it takes me down to my transaction it shows how much time is pending and it shows whether it will be unconfirmed and it says I'm overpaying the fee by 15% it's okay and yeah now this is how the Bitcoin will be showed so in the next video when I come out here I will show you how the Bitcoin is in this card and how I can swipe so let's just wait about for three to four blocks to so that it is confirmed on the mempool and once it is confirmed there we're gonna retrieve bitcoin from this using nunchuck it's an application and using that application we will withdraw bitcoin from here and swipe it back to my account this is awesome what is that card as such it's a wireless nfc smart card that can hold bitcoin you can hand it to someone else and they and they control the balance simple as that the apps to be used here is nunchuck so we'll be using the nunchuck eventually and yeah let's do this let's go let's in fact get the nunchuck app you go into the nunchuck click on nunchuck 
it goes to install I'm installing my nunchuck and let's wait a minute okay all right it's done I'm gonna go click on this and click on open it goes open and that's it your wallet is ready and there is something called here in NFC I'm gonna click on NFC and I'm gonna go take my card locate phones NFC chip got it ready to scan hold the key near the device this hold it near I'm holding it boom it showed my QR code but it shows the balance is how much zero there is nothing on there as of now so we have to wait for the mempool confirmation and once the confirmation is done I will show you how it says to unseal and sweep the balance so it's scanned and it shows there's a balance now of 50,000 sats and it here it gives you an option of unseal and sweep the balance so I'm just gonna click on unseal and sweep the balance is like is it sweep to a wallet or sweep to an address and I'm just gonna click on sweep to an address and I have to put in my address here so now I'm gonna go back to my wallet here and I'm gonna click here receive copy and I'm gonna put in my address here paste it says customize fee and it says about an estimated fees it gives you it shows you everything right now that you can sweep your balance off it you know and the fee will be detected and okay cool I'm gonna click on continue it says confirm and sweep the balance so this is how it is showing everything like how much my balance is from my what wallet address to what wallet it's going confirm and sweep balance and now it asks me to enter the pin now this is the pin that is on the card you see the pin here it says five five four seven four six I'm just gonna type in here five five four seven four six I click confirm it says ready to, ready to scan hold the card key now I will not just let me so if even if you have my keys but if you don't have this card you can't still access it so I'm gonna hold my card here and it's scanning, scanning, and boom, gone. It says pending confirmations, and my sats are gone. I can go to more details. I can view on the blockchain explorer here. And yep, it goes to mempool. It shows unconfirmed. It shows the amount of fees I've paid, and then how much time will this be confirmed. If I go back to my card here, and let's say now back to nunchuck as soon as i click on this if i click on nfc and i hold my card here what does it say view unseen slots this is what it's showing it's ah so sorry as of now it's going through my sats are going out of here but i click on the nfc i'm gonna put this here and it says view unsealed slots if I click on view unsealed slots it shows how much my sats are going through once this card is unsealed you have nine more times to use this card so this card can just be used ten times but that is pretty cool enough for somebody who doesn't have an application right now and I really like this option and I could just get some Bitcoin in it so this is greetings from Nostarica 2023 sats card you can get it from CoinKite I will upload this video for you guys to just check it out and I will add another sex aspect to it to just see how it shows you how many slots are open you can just use it 10 times so there yeah. I have received back my sats 49 146 I lost about 840 on the fees and that's about it so if I go back on my nunchuck now I click on nunchuck I click on NFC and I click on my scan phone it opens your phone and it tells you your QR code and what does it say it's unsealed be careful it says be careful this slot is unsealed this means that the private key is known and public so that's about it take care of your card take care of your password and that's it this is the end I have finally figured it out this is what I was looking to show you guys this was very important 10 times your card transfer Bitcoin share bitcoin share loves let the sats flow peace take it sharp